We started out with a small idea. We wanted to create the world's first interactive radio drama. We were mobile first to begin with. Luckily, Alexa came along. I remember, you know, I told my team, okay, I think we're gonna make a pivot here. I think we're gonna focus on Alexa. I have thousands and thousands of connects. And I'm like, why not try and learn Alexa and do something cool with the Raspberry Pi? I remember I spent almost an entire weekend doing it, like barely any sleep. My first skill is pretty simple. It's called Black History Every Day. Patricia Bath, first black woman to serve on staff. It started to work on April 3rd, 2017, which happened to be my 60th birthday. And I cried when it worked. I cried tears of joy. Tell unofficial Raspberry Pi car to move the car forward. The car is moving forward. We are driving my car, but it's my voice. <laughs> SmartCap takes the images from the camera and it interprets what's in the image. And then it narrates the scene to the visually impaired person through Amazon Alexa. Alexa, ask SmartCap to describe the scene. It is a desk with a monitor and a laptop computer sitting on a table. As soon as I saw the video of the person using the device, it was a eureka moment for me and the feeling from inside is like, you are doing something good in life and it can help others to achieve what they want. One of the other projects I created, I called it Alexa in the browser. You could just go to a web page and you had a, a virtual echo, it was just a, a white circle on the page. And it became a product called echosim.io, which is a echo simulator. It's amazing, I, I go to events and I see people kind of developing Echo skills and they fire up echosim.io on their laptop and they just sort of talk to Alexa through that and it's like, oh yeah, that's, that's running my code underneath. <laughs> We're on the cusp of a revolution, a voice revolution. Voice definitely is the most powerful medium I can say which can change the world. And now is the time to, to start learning this stuff and to get involved in it because so many developers you look at and go, oh, if I could have gone back 10 years ago. As a result of the shift of voice, we've reached a much, much broader audience than we ever thought was possible. That is a much bigger future than anything that I had originally expected.